Hey guys, it's Ashlyn. So in today's video, I'm going to be giving you quite a few Christmas ideas. I have them all in my notes and there's different categories. So I'll have Christmas ideas that you can get for your kid, probably kind of like my age, gift ideas for your friends, and then also just a couple ideas that you could do for your family. You guys may already know about all these things, but if you are clueless on what to get someone or you just need ideas for your own Christmas list, then this is a pretty good list that I think a lot of people could relate to or like want. This isn't my own Christmas list, but any of this stuff is stuff that I would personally like but I don't really have like a Christmas wish list this year It honestly like makes me uncomfortable making a list for someone to like buy I don't know because I feel bad on Christmas like my parents get me stuff year-round and like they do all this stuff for me and then it's like it's almost like they're forced to get stuff on Christmas I don't know every year it's just like I don't want to make a list because it makes me uncomfortable but with all that being said here are the ideas that i have the first category is like for your child if you're a mom watching this or need ideas for like it probably a teenager then here's some ideas the first thing is clothes which is obviously a given but some stores that have some really cute clothes are princess polly lululemon and nike princess polly has a ton of different clothes it's honestly more on the expensive side but anybody i know really likes princess polly stuff and i just placed an order on there so I think that's a safe bet. Also, Lululemon, who doesn't love some nice workout clothes. And then Nike has a ton of cute shoes and a ton of cute, like, sweatshirts or workout gear. Really, just a lot of different stuff. And then the next thing I had was shoes. Nike, Adidas, the usual. You could get them some new Air Force Ones if their Air Forces are dirty. Just stuff like that. And then I said things for coffee. So, like, personally, I love coffee. So, mom, if you're watching this. I really want to get a like coffee machine where you could just like have your espresso and then you make your own like espresso shots at home because I spend too much money on coffee so I think that'd be a very good investment so you could do that and then along with that just like coffee beans or like if you have a Keurig like Keurig k-cups stuff like that and then I also put room decor so like a lot of girls like these little vines i have them in my room you could do like led lights i don't know if that's as relevant now as it used to be but i have mine on all the time so that's a safe bet and then i have these little like plant things all over my room there's some like over there these like vine succulent things i think those are really cute and i know a lot of girls enjoy little plants around their room and then i also put a scentsy with different scents for it. I know my parents don't love candles. They're kind of scary a little bit, but I do have one going over there. Not to say I don't ever use them, but uh, a scentsy is a really great thing to have. I use mine all the time. I've had mine for probably a couple of years now and it's still perfect and I have it on all the time. So my room smells like Christmas trees right now because of it and I know places like Target has some good scents, but I usually get mine from Walmart or you could get the scentsy brand scents but there's a ton and great for all year round because you can do like summer scents winter scents fall scents spring scents everything and it just makes your room smell so good i also put an alarm clock and there's the specific one that my psychology teacher mentioned on amazon and basically there's like a ton of stuff that you can do with it and you can research it more but it like has like a natural light setting so it like won't like beep at you like crazy it actually like wakes you up with light and then has like a sound to it i don't even know pairs with your phone i think it's really cool personally something that i would love to buy myself at some point but it's really cool and i think that it would be great because my alarm clock now it just doesn't do the job i don't wake up it's bad another thing that i know a lot of girls like is stuff for their keychains so like i have this little wallet thing it's like a mini little wallet and you can keep cards in it and money and then there's a little coin slot for it it's from coach but i think my mom got it on poshmark and then those little wrist things i used to have one of those but they're honestly so handy and there's a reason for why a lot of girls have those then you don't lose your keys so easily because it's humongous and then also it's just really cute and also very handy to have then something that's probably easier for like a parent to get a child is like shampoo and conditioner because it's honestly a great thing to get because you can get one that they have been wanting or like a nicer one to try out i personally use the nexus one it's 
a volumizing one, I believe. It's in the green bottle, and I love it. I've been through a couple of those bottles, and I think that's a really great shampoo and conditioner. Could be like a stocking stuffer. And then I also put perfume, and this could be something that you could get like a significant other as well. The one that I had on my Christmas list was the Versace Bright Crystal Perfume. It smells so good. It definitely is a more expensive perfume, but that is why you can ask for it for Christmas. The next category is gift ideas for your friends. This is more of like a personal thing, probably because all friends are different friend groups like you probably have something cute you can already like think of for your friends but here's if you don't have any ideas pretty basic stuff but first thing is like Bath and Body Works candles hand sanitizer lotion car scents I always have a car scent in my car and it's always from Bath and Body Works and you can get one for the season it just makes getting in your car just a great experience because your car just smells so good and then hand sanitizer is a great thing for right now because Rona. Don't want that, so I always have hand sanitizer in my car. And then I'm always using Bath & Body Works perfumes. They're just great staples to have. Really just Bath & Body Works anything is a great safe bet for any of your friends, family, whoever. And then I think a more cute thing would be like pictures of you two together or whoever, like your big friend group. I think it's more of like a special gift. So like for my friend's birthday, I made her like a little book and had a picture of us on each um, page and then like a little description of why you like that picture and I don't know just like a special little gift it's more of a personal gift and if you have like a best friend I think that's a really good idea and it's something that lasts forever so it's really cute and then obviously gift cards to their favorite place if the person likes Starbucks Starbucks gift card or a local coffee shop also like reusable cups for coffee so you could do like either a mug or like I always use my Starbucks reusable cup. It's just like a little $3 plastic Starbucks cup. And I'm pretty sure in the store, if you, I don't know if they're still doing this because of Rona, but there was like a 10 cent discount if you brought in your cup, but I don't think they're actually doing that anymore. But I use it if I make coffee at home, it's a really good gift idea because it's something that they could use all the time. And then PJ shorts or like a PJ set. And you guys could get matching ones if you want. For my friend's birthday party a year ago, she got everyone matching PJ shorts and I still wear them and they're so cute. Or like fuzzy socks. I know Old Navy does these fuzzy sock deals around Christmas time and they're really comfy and really cute that you could wear all the time. Or you can make them a treat and put it in this cute little like jar or bag such as like Christmas cake pops or like Christmas cookies. That could be a really cute gift idea. Or like water bottles and put their favorite candy in it. You know, the basic stuff like that. Maybe, I don't know, they want to work out more in the new year. They could bring their water bottle that you got them. And the last two things I just put like their favorite candy as a little add-in thing. Or jewelry with their initial on it. Just cute jewelry that you think that they would like. So places like Francesca's, I know a lot of people go there that I'm friends with and really any website has a cute jewelry. And then the last category is gift ideas for your family. And I only thought of three things, but really family, it's like a more personal gift probably. So you probably have more ideas than me. Something that's pretty universal, I feel like, is these three things. So mug for their morning coffee. I know my mom is always drinking coffee in the morning. My dad does too every once in a while. I know some websites you can make little mugs and put a picture from your camera roll on it, or you could do words. And I think that could be really cute for them. So whenever they have their morning coffee, it's like, good vibes. I also thought of like a handwritten letter with your favorite printed picture of you together. That's what I put. Um, I know one year I made my grandparents like a little poem. I don't know. It was pretty cute and they have it framed. I made one for my grandma and one for my grandpa and it was honestly so cute and they loved it. So that's a great idea for your grandparents if you want to write a poem for them. It doesn't even have to be that. Just like a cute little picture of you guys together. Could be for your parents too and then just put like some words on it that's like special it'd be really cute to open i know they would love it and then the last thing i put is jewelry with your name on it so like if your mom wears necklaces or your grandma you could put little words on it customize them and i feel like family would really enjoy that stuff but with all that being said that is all of the ideas that i thought of for 
this year. I've actually never done a video like this, but let me know if you end up using any of these ideas. <laughs> um, I know a lot of them are probably stuff that you've already thought of yourself, but maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, I am doing Vlogmas on my vlog channel this year. Um, really hoping that I can finish it this year. But if you're not already subscribed, go subscribe to my vlog channel and be ready for videos every day of December. That is all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!